the great civic uh, and political turning points of American history uh, are these great, um, you know, crisis or transformation moments, which are separated from each other by about the length of a long human life, you know, about 80 years or so, 80 or 90 years. Uh, it's been that span has been actually diminishing slightly over time. We think it might actually begin to grow again. But if you look, for instance, between probably the first great colonial crisis, the, the, the glorious revolution in America, which was in the 1690s, and you go ahead a long human life and you come to the American Revolution, you go ahead about the same period of time you come to the Civil War, and then you come to World War II and the Great Depression. And then you come to where we are today, uh, Jim. So yeah. uh, that's kind of the fourth turning is here. And, and interestingly, about halfway in between these great outer world crisis moments are the great inner world crisis periods of our history. Uh, these have been called the great awakenings or the great revitalization movements, right? And we actually give them ordinal names. We call it the first great awakening, the second great awakening, the third great awakening. Um, many historians call the late 1960s and 70s uh, America's fourth or fifth great awakening, depending mm -hmm. if you want to start your count with, you know, with John Winthrop or, or Jonathan Edwards, right? But these come roughly halfway in between. And it suggests an interesting rhythm of inner world reconstruction followed by outer world reconstruction. 